morning. Today just happens to be the 22nd day of this particular month. Now, I actually haven't recorded any of my reflections for the last two days. And there's a reason for it. You know, I'm really following, you know, the guidance of the spirit because I can sometimes (laughs) create work. (laughs) I can create uh, unnecessary things And, and for myself, you know, I will even sometimes do things to create chaos just so that I can fix it. You know, <laughs> and it doesn't really involve anyone else. You know, it's just my stuff, you know, and multiple projects and things. And I really needed to take time. And I'm glad because, you know, I had an opportunity to speak to my therapist <laughs> this week. Uh, and, you know, something I'm, I've committed to uh, for my health, uh, especially as I get, you know, closer and closer to, you know, another age. Um, I want a different life. I, I want everything to have meaning. I want to see the meaning in everything, which really means that I need to get focused, you know, and I need to slow down, you know. So one of the things that uh, many people don't know that I do, um, I, I love photography. And it's not just the idea of taking pictures. It's really a, therapy for me and because when when you I'm not talking about using your cell phone <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about literally getting a camera a DSLR uh, a semi-professional I don't think I'm ready for <laughs> the heavy-duty professional with lenses and you know and learning the technical aspects uh, of getting a great picture but really it's just about getting a great shot but then there are some things that you have to pay attention to and one of the most important elements is light that's why I use this as a therapy Uh, you know it causes me to slow down It, it makes me to pay attention to you know life like that one little flower that's growing in the midst of a field of weeds. You know, it's like there's hope in the middle of everything that's going on, you know, and I have to stop, I have to focus and position it right. Slow down, breathe easy, because even my breathing affects the shot, right? Understanding all of these things how much weight is on me as I'm trying to focus. And I'm pointing out a few of these words um, for a reason, like light and focus. You know, because today's focus scripture, you know, it it says, but, and it comes from 2 Chronicles 15 and 7. It says, but as for you, and I like how this starts off, you know. Now, now it says that something happened before, but this particular scripture, Second Chronicles, fifteen and seven. Second Chronicles, fifteen and seven. Fifteen and seven. Fifteen and seven. Today happens to be July 22nd. It'll make sense in a minute. But as for you, so, you know, a part of these reflections, my reflections are just that, my reflections. And, you know, as I was doing these and and recording, it became work, you know, and I made it chaotic for me and I was rushing, trying to get my 
reflections down, you know, which was strange because I had already done what I promised to do for those who are following this devotion. But I started to make something that was very personal to me available <laughs> for everyone. I was too available. And, and there are some times and there are some moments in life where it's just about you. It's not for anyone else. That's why it's called my reflections. But I have to share even this part of it because it's the lesson that was learned. And so that's why I was gone for two days. So as for you, Darren, here's what you need to do. Be strong and do not give up. For your work will be rewarded. And there's many things that I could say about Second Chronicles 15 and 7, you know, and about my work. You know, because I, I really do things because I love people with no intentions. And, you know, and maybe I need to change my mindset and, and realize that I should also be working because there is a reward and, you know, there, there's something to, that's the goal. Now, it may be different for everyone. Mine is never monetary, you know, and I think I share this with someone else. It's about the number of lives that I can impact. That's always the end goal. How can I take this what I have and impact the most lives? Oh.